Hey y'all, this is a quick little introduction to my uh, could be YouTube channel. You know what you do? You just like setting up your song. You do your makeup. Oh, okay. <laughs> We're live. Oh, yay! <laughs> Anywho. All right, so I started with this primer, matte primer. Um, It's pretty cool. And then I went in with the Fenty Beauty um uh, foundation. I just started using foundation, y'all. Y'all know I don't use foundation. I usually just go straight into my highlight and contour. Um, I've already done my makeup or my eye makeup tonight for work. We are wearing camo, so I went with an army green. And then after I'm done with the highlight and contour, I'm gonna go underneath and do a nice uh, olive green under my eye. Hi, all the guys that's joining. I wish there were some ladies. You hoes it. No hoes. Okay. All right. So. For um my highlight, I use uh, Sydney's here, y'all. If y'all hear somebody in the background, that's her. <laughs> For my highlight, I like to use the Rimmel London Perfect Match 430 Medium. Now they stopped selling this in the stores, so I had to, big head. Oh, you niggas is disrespectful. My head is small. Um, so I had to order this off of Amazon. This is again. For y'all that's just joining, this is a practice for me in, in doing a YouTube makeup page. So, yeah. So, for the highlight, we go underneath the eyes, down the middle of the nose, forehead, sometimes chin. It just depends on how I am. You know, I don't like to wear a lot of makeup, so this is a light makeup look. And we only doing this live for like five minutes, so however far I get five minutes. That's what y'all gonna see. At least until I start getting good at this and I start editing my videos and chopping them up and putting music to it and shit. Hi, person that I don't know. Hi, Marcus. I'm just telling the people how to uh, get a nice makeup look using hair store makeup because my makeup isn't very expensive at all. At all. Thank you. Thank you, Kurt. Are you joining? Y'all, Sydney joining the live. <laughs> hey, Sid. Okay, so again, we go underneath the eyes, um, and I like to blend and then go into the different parts and then blend. I don't like to put it all on at once and then blend it all because I feel like it all gets mixed together. Um, and I use two different sponges for chop it, chop it up, chop it up. Um, I use a sponge for the highlight and I use a sponge for the contour. And I always do a liquid highlight and contour and then go on top of everything with a powder. Um, when I first started doing makeup, my favorite like go-to look, I would always do like a pink eyeshadow. Why? Because pink is my favorite color and I feel like it looks good on me. Um, and then I started following a bunch of girls on YouTube and Instagram that did makeup. And that really helped me. Uh, to this day, I still like look up different women and see what they do. And then I just do that. Okay, so we already put the highlight underneath the eyes. So then we gotta go into making these cheekbones, honey. Okay. And I don't do a lot at first because it's dark. I need to be able to blend it out. And if I need to add more after, then I just do that. Hey, bun on fleek. Hey, T. How's grandma? My girl. <laughs> okay, so again, I use a different sponge to go in with the contour. Does she not going to say nothing? Bit. <laughs> I'm just speaking to her. She not speaking back. Oh, okay. oh, oh. She said annoying. <laughs> Maybe you go pick out a wig. <laughs> That's my girl. She's not annoying. Oh, 
little man. That's big homie, y'all. He been fat ass for as long as I've known. <laughs> Destiny. Bet. She had me tie on and wear wigs. Girl, I know. You got beautiful hair. Call me Destiny again. Fat ass. <laughs> so I love y'all. You know that's his name. Okay. Y'all see that cheekbone? Whew, that's crazy. Okay, so um, then I go into contour <laughs> contouring and highlighting my nose, which doesn't need much work because I got a, a cute little nose. Thank God I've been blessed, but that's all I do. Okay, okay, so I put a little bit, oh, look at you guys. <laughs> a little bit of that. And there's oral B power brushing. Oral and a little bit of this. Better. Even my hygienist said going electric could lead to way cleaner teeth. She said it's Are we watching how to get away with murder? Brown brush head is inspired by death. Alright, I'm gonna head out. <laughs> you saw me just head out. That's crazy. is the first electric toothbrush brand accepted by the ADA. What an amazing clean. I'll okay, only okay. use an oral B. Oral B. Brush like a pro. All right, so again, two different sponges. It's just me. Hey, Brian! Oh my God, I've seen you so long. Okay. So we blend that. That look pretty light on the camera. That's crazy. It don't look like this a person. <laughs> and then we blend out the contour. And again, this is something that I do all the time for my nose because I don't really need it. But if I'm going to put makeup on, I might as well put it all on. You know, the whole face. Ooh, you. I'm going to need you to come and unmount the TV soon. We're moving. I'm happy you joined. And then we're going to have to get remounted at our new place. Boom. Okay, so that is all I do. For the um the liquid portion and then i go in with my powders and uh go over everything that i just did with liquid and then some so i always start with my cheekbones and i use what is this highlight and contour palette from nyx oh look how strong i look it's because of sydney over there it's great it's muscle I use the the chocolate brown and then the light brown as well okay I do a couple dabs you know shake off the excess I'm now going with light strokes and circular motions on top of the um liquid that I already put there for the the contour okay boom see once you um you see the difference maybe not I can tell though And do the same thing to this side. Okay. Look at that. We are we are making dimensions in our face, honey. Yeah. You feel me? Hey, Rashad. <laughs> okay. So. After that, we go and put the powder on top of everything that we put the light. Uh oh, fucking me. Uh oh, on top of everything that we put the light. Uh, found. What is this? What is this? The highlighter on. I'm getting it together, y'all. Getting it together. Okay. So I go in with banana powder. It's yellow. I'm a little golden goddess. You know, it works for me. Okay. So I put some of it in the cap. 
like so. Uh, <laughs> and do a little dip dab, a little dip dab like that. And I start with it underneath the eyes. And this is what we call baking, guys. We are baking, honey. Okay. Okay. And you don't got to be too uh, careful with it. You know, just put a nice, generous amount on. You're going to rub it off after you're finished baking. So whatever doesn't stay, you just wipe off the excess. Again, for all of you that are joining, uh, we are wearing camo outfits today. So that's why I decided to do a green eye. And if you really look, it's like an ombre. So it starts like lime green and then it gets into like a dark green. Okay, so we do that. I'll ring it around here. We do underneath here. The voice of Houston. I am getting ready for work eventually. I'm going. I'm going to work. I gotta make a pit stop. Okay, so you put that under there and you create <laughs> like he's a mighty daddy. I know. Shit. You put that under there and you create that little cheek, that cheekbone right there. Look at that. Look at that. Woo! That girl got cheekbones. It's crazy. <laughs> he said, "Hey, Sid." <laughs> She right here. Hey. <laughs> yeah, Bam. Boom. Okay, so now I am creating all types of angles on this little face, honey. Which is what the hoes want. Oh, it's a party. It's always a party, babe. Okay. And then we go into the nose. Look at that boom, boom, boom. Why settle for one note grab and go breakfast? When the McDonald's kitchen is a sizzling, toasty, simply. Meanwhile, at the gym. At the gym. You got people in there getting body by Beezy. And then I put a little bit on my forehead. So a lot of girls, they'll go in and they'll put like contour on their forehead and all around there I literally never do that I don't know why I have a tiny forehead so I don't really feel like I need to okay so now we bake <laughs> what do you say <laughs> all right BZ <laughs> you look good let's roll oh it's Friday see so I won't see you tonight Tomorrow, I'll do my makeup like this, just for you, just for you. Um, okay, so whenever I do like a bold eye, I always go for a nude lip. Um, nude lip for me is a dark brown liner with a like light nude lipstick and then I usually put like a little pink on the inside and then mix it all. It'll be like a pretty ombre and then a lip gloss and I'll show you guys that. Um, Where's my lipstick? I took it out of my purse. One second. Okay, I'm back. All right. So my liner is from NYX. It is color Espresso. I like how the uh, YouTube girls be doing this when they show y'all what they use. And then I lip. I line my lip. I said this is only gonna be five minutes. I lied. Okay. So we got the line all around. Some areas are darkening up more to see give me. More dimensions. My father's in prison here. Maybe I'm waiting for the clerk to tell me. So I like to do like a line in the middle. A couple other lines.
and then I go in with a nude. What color is this? Cherish by Mac. That pretty, pretty color. Yeah, it's okay to like overlap it. Hey, BBG. We're talking makeup. Okay. See how pretty that is. And if your nude is too nude, hey ho. Wow. Hey, Tika. <laughs> Oh goodness. If it's too nude, then I like to go in the middle with a pink. And this pink is um it's some little brand in the makeup store, honestly. It's a really, really pretty pink. I love you too, baby. When I put it on, like with that liner, it just looks like my lip color is so pretty. I always get compliments on it. And sometimes just a matte lip is cool but if you want some shine baby throw on some shiny lip gloss this is a Victoria's Secret minty shine on it's flavored ladies my man loves me <laughs> no girl I'm getting ready for work um or you can just do a regular uh, shiny lip gloss that's not flavored but I think we've been baking long enough so it's time to wipe it all off and I use a big brush. I have a couple big brushes that I use to go in and take it off. And then I use this little one to get into the corners. So you get off all the excess. I haven't cleaned my brushes this week, so I need to do that. I'll probably do it Monday. And you just go in and start wiping off your banana powder. Pom-poms? What does that mean? <laughs> okay, if someone who doesn't wear makeup. <laughs> okay, my pom-poms. <laughs> We're almost done, guys. Wipe it all off. And sometimes for the corners, um, I feel like it gets stuck in there, so I use like a, a the smaller brush to get that. Ooh, Tika, we're coming out to LA next month. Me and Boney, but I meant to text you that this last night when we decided. If you're still watching, I have to text her. Yeah, bitch. What days? Um, I think the eleventh. Whatever. I'll text you. We think you would really shine in the Affleck program. Affleck. Come see them. We have. Hopefully, you'll be in town. Oh, it's about to be lit! I said the same thing. I'm so excited. Woo! <laughs> okay. So. Once you have gotten all of the excess banana powder off of your face, I like to darken up my beauty marks. Yes, uh, Packers and Chargers. Um, so I have a beauty mark here that I like to darken up. I have a beauty mark here. Yes, yes. Okay, so I made this one too dark, but 
That's okay, cause my bang is on this side, so we're just gonna. Uh, yeah. So you only pay for what you need. Switch now. Oh my god. And then I like to add one here. There is no beauty mark here, but I'm gonna add it because that's my thing. I don't wanna hear shit about it. Okay, that, that's a little dry. So, you know, we got more than one eyeliner. Boom. So, after you do that, you gotta go in with your uh, blush. And your sparkly highlight. The blush that I have is from MAC. I've had it since I was in college. I graduated four years ago. So I think it's a good little uh, it's a good little investment. Uh it's whatever. Yeah, of course. We are still fans. Okay, y'all see that? Police. Not too much. I feel like too much blush makes you look like a strumpet. Mm -hmm. For those of y'all don't know what a strumpet is, ask your grandma. Oh, okay, so we do that. And then, another secret for my highlight, I use this Diamond Dust Eyeshadow. It's, oh, it's the bomb. I found it in this hair store when I was living in Dallas. Um, and I have to look online to buy some more because I, I have not seen it since. Okay, so here's a trick. If you want your highlight to stay, uh, spray on your finishing powder and while it's still like wet, then you put your, uh, your highlight on. Still wet. That's a bit. Woo. Do that. Like, oh, the girl is shining. I sound like I'm from Texas. I don't like that. <laughs> Look at it. Look at it. Oh, it's pretty. And I like to highlight my nose. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The bridge and uh, right here. Um, I said I was going to do a green under my eye, and I think I still want to do that, the smoky green. Okay, so I got this makeup box for Christmas in college. My parents got it for me forever ago, and it has like all these different colors. And all these different powers. Okay, so this is like the, the color green. This was my idea to illustrate the horror of my client's inhumane living conditions. This living conditions are not an issue. Article 37 of the UN Convention on Rights of Children demands no child shall be subjected to torture. By that standard alone, my client deserves asylum. Google Court says Chief Justice will not meant to secure our Look at it. Wow, so cute. And then we do it for the other eye as well. Just last year, the Chief Justice wrote that the internment of Japanese Americans in World War II was morally repugnant. Look at this boy. Can you honestly Okay, I got a little bit of it in my eye. That's okay. Okay. And now my face is fully beat. I've taken you guys all through it. I'll take pictures once I do my hair. I'm probably just gonna spray some water in it. This is Dynasty's Empire here, by the way. My hair. And we'll get more into that as well. But um, thank you guys for watching my live. Have a good day. If you're in Houston, come to the address. Tip me. I would love to take your money. <laughs> Bye.